In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up Android for VMware. This is useful if you're trying to make a recording on something to do with Android, but you don't want to use your phone or tablet. The first thing you want to do is install VMware. I already have that installed. The next thing I want to do is download the ISO image from android-x86.org slash download. And we're going to choose this one right here. And we're going to choose the first file. So it's about 800 megabytes. While that's downloading, we're going to go ahead and create our VM. From VMware, click Create New Virtual Machine. Choose Typical. Select the installer from your Downloads folder. This is the ISO that we just downloaded. You can choose the default path or customize it to your own. And go ahead and use the recommended settings and click Finish. Once the VM is created, it will automatically power on. And you have the option here to automatic boot, uh, live CD auto Android without installation, live CD Visa mode, live CD debug mode, and installation. So from this screen, we're going to select install. And once the screen comes up, we're gonna click on create and modify partitions. And it's asking if we wanna use GPT when we wanna tell it no. Next thing you want to do is uh, go to modify your partition. So we first have to create a partition and do new. And you can now select this as bootable. and then we're gonna choose right. Okay, and then we're going to quit. And then we're gonna choose SDA1. And we're going to choose ext4. It's going to ask us if we want to format, and let's choose yes. And it's going to ask, do you want to install bootloader grub? And you're going to tell this yes as well. On the next question, uh, do you want to install system directory as read write? Making system read write is easier for debugging, but it needs more disk space and longer installation. We're going to choose yes as well. So after it gets finished installing, it's going to prompt us if we want to run or reboot. And we're going to choose the option to reboot, and we're going to remove the DVD ISO image. So you're going to choose reboot and hit OK. It's rebooting now. You can right click, choose removable device, CD, disconnect. You can view this in full screen by clicking view full screen. And now you have Android installed on your VM.